Hey everyone, it's Dr. Evil, and welcome back to Factorio. I'm joined as ever by Nedo Gamer. Hello, Nog. Hello, hello. You are playing with mines. mines. Yep. And even though I just picked up half a train worth of miners, I don't think it's going to be enough. Ah. Right. I, I've been babysitting this little build here, and this is way better. Way, way better. Um, it does kind of require you to get to stack and insert a tech, however, that's the only drawback. So it's not an early game build. Okay. Your nuclear's not an early game build, anyway, is it? So. No, that's true. Where where did you get stack inserters? What? Uh. Not sure. I think you get it before you get nuclear. You do. You do get stack inserters. You get stack filter inserters when you get stack inserters. Mm hmm And that's way before you're even doing oil processing. So so yeah, so as soon as as soon as you get here you can build this. Yeah, awesome. Okay. Okay. And this is all working and all running and they produce one extra every cycle. Uh they're running at point seven speed, aren't they? Craft speed is 0.9 because the productivity module runs so in there. Uh, so they take um, 66 seconds. So uh, that's every seven seconds we're getting one uranium 235. Okay. Cool. Rough. That's very rough. Very rough math there. But hopefully that's that's that is correct. And we have boxes and stuff up here as well, again. Um <laughs> But that's all good. That's all good. Away you go. Okay, and then you come down here, you do all your thing here, you come down here, and the ordering here is important because it's important that this uh filter inserter gets priority on the belt to the other ones coming in. Otherwise, I'd just run the belt down normally, but because it needs to make sure it drops its goods off. If it does drop the goods off, everything goes wrong. We are, however, going to run out of actual space on the belt because I messed up and put some stuff on the wrong side of the belt, but that's not a problem. Uh, that's more that we actually need to use our uranium. We're not actually using uh, uranium to 35 anywhere. So. And Nog suggested rocket fuel, not rocket fuel, uh, rocket trains. Yep. Nuclear vessels. Ooh. I think that could be good. Why? Oh, oh dear, something's gone very wrong with the oil. What's that? We don't have any lubricant being made. Okay. Well, Which I... isn't terrible, because it's only used in belts, I think, isn't it? Uh, I'm not actually sure. I'm not actually sure. It must be used in something else as well. We're still getting plenty of petroleum. That's the important stuff. Yeah. Uh, I, I think I, I mean I know it's used in belt production for blue belts. Uh, why do I not click on the train? I find out train. You can drop off belts. No, it's useless. That's useless because you can't cycle through the drop offs. Which is... Yeah, that's a little annoying. I don't understand. I just don't understand why. So you click one, it goes to the nearest one. Oh, it's also used in electric engines. Ah! Uh, and electric engines are used for science. That may cause a problem. Right, okay, okay. Uh, well, I want to go up there anyway, because I want to go and uh, uh, mess about with trains. Because we want to make some nuclear fuel. And... We should, we should move the train refueling, shouldn't we? Really? Uh... Yeah, probably. 
or have two. Well, there are two stops there now. Oh, okay. And I did find an issue with it. Um, there was a signal missing. Uh huh. Uh, so every time a train came in to pick up or to drop off crude oil, um, it would block the whole system. Mm hmm. Because there was a there was a single uh, uh, signal missing for that crude oil. So uh, okay. that's why it kept backing up. Now it doesn't do it. Now it seems to work fine. Um, but now we could really do with some actual proper like nuclear fuel being made and dropped off here. So, um, well, we want to get it made and then we just want to have it done. So, I, I suppose we could put that down uh, below the grenade production. Mm hmm. I am actually, I actually ran out of power in my suit. <laughs> yep, too many robots. Too many robots. So let us do that. Let me copy this. And then let us come down here and put it in here but I can't put it in here because um like an idiot I ran a belt I keep pushing the wrong button uh I ran a belt uh across and now that belt was in the way. Uh-huh. So much uranium I didn't actually think we needed that much uranium, and then obviously when I've added loads to it, it's like, ah, oh, yes, no, you don't need that much uranium, so now you're stuffed with it. <laughs> you've got all this uranium and nothing to do with it. What you gonna, what you gonna suffer with? What you gonna do for that? Ha ha. Damn you. Uh, because this is terrible. This is terrible. I've got three. Let's redo this. Let's rebuild this here. So... All the belts and all the miners I just grabbed, we are about two-thirds of the way done with setting up that iron. Okay, this is completely full and just waiting for trains, that's good. We actually have seven, well now six, again seven, copper ore trains just sitting there waiting to be able to go and drop their stuff off. Where's my train going? Get fuel maybe? Maybe. Oh, it's your train. Uh, no, it's not. Where, where did it go? I don't know. Never mind. We have so much copper on our smelting setup that the trains don't even want to go and drop it off. <laughs> That's pretty crazy. And we have... Almost no iron. Do that. Left, right, left, right. There we go. Okay, that seems better. That seems better. Okay. Now that's flowing from everywhere at once. Awesome. And I picked up another. 50, 100 uranium. Shoo, uranium, shoo. I'm going to pick up more in just a moment anyway, but that's fine. That's fine. So what I'm going to do is uh, I need to put some form of fuel in my train. We're going to be wood-powered once again, train. Congratulations. We're going to drive all the way down here and crash into the back of that train. 
Bump the cars. No. Oh god. Who put all these boxes here? <laughs> <laughs> uh, either you or me. Well, how dare they? Let's put those in the trash slot. Let's put that in the trash. Uh, no down there. I would, I would be sending right. all the trains up here to a fueling stop and then down to that roundabout to come back again. That's probably not the smartest thing to do here. No. You going? No. Where are we going? Oh, because I'm hitting right. control instead of ship. Ready? So we need more oil, right? Yes. So there are out at the iron here. There are actually four crude oils things. One of them them with a yield of six thousand percent. One of them with a yield of more than seven thousand percent. Seven thousand three hundred ninety-nine. Oh, very nice. Cut off those ones. Right, we have arrived. All of this stuff. No, 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 no. You go back here. I try. Why are my own logistics robots not helping out with this? I think that's weird. Maybe they'll strike. Yeah, maybe. You know, you've been working us too hard, starving us for, <laughs> for power. Yeah. Just not good enough, these work conditions. That's as much as I can carry. So let's head back down here. Ishin in between there, is that something that's possible? It is. Oh. Oh. Oh, we might just do that. Do what? Why not? Why not? I was gonna have loads of parking and then like a stop for uh, uh, refueling. Mhm. Mm uh, why not just make the parking the refueling? Yeah. Why not literally just do do that and then. Uh... Have them all as refueling stops. And then, what do you need to make uh, nuclear? Uh... Oh, we need rocket fuel. We don't have rocket fuel being made yet. Oh, no. Oh. We need rocket fuel for nuclear fuel? Yeah. yeah. Okay. You need a rocket fuel and one uranium. Mm hmm. I didn't know that. That, that kind of. Uh... That, 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 that affects this. Yeah, definitely affect this because I wasn't expecting to have to make rocket fuel or anything. But then we do need rocket fuel anyway, don't we? Yeah, we do, and a lot of it. So um, that's going to be built elsewhere anyway. So I could build the start of this. I feel.
And I am almost drained for power again. <laughs> That is insane. I want the robot using so much power. Yeah, the problem is that I can't get so I need to do every other stop. Ooh, and dang it, I need power poles. Oh, well, I'm gonna have to go back and get those. There's still some things that are missing. Huh. Am I seriously out? Uh, oh, no, no. Ready? Come on, jump in. What? I can't count. Hmm. Well, starts with one and ends with infinity. Yeah, but it's all the numbers in between then, the problem. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> um, yeah, I was like, I, w I want five stops, and then I put in seven. But like, oh, uh, I had ten, I took all the odd ones out, and then I added two to. What? Uh, yeah. <laughs> we've got five stops and we got a drop off because that must be a drop off now. Okay, okay. So there we go. So that's all in place, ready to do whatever it's going to do. There's going to be a centrifuge down here or two. How long does this take to make? 90 seconds. Wow. Okay. Okay. Wow, that takes 90 seconds to make a nuclear fuel. Ooh That's quite a long time. That, that is that is a surprising amount of time, actually. Um, yeah. So we're going to need multiple centrifuges. Centrifuges. Alright, so we are on our way up to get some uh, electric poles, and I suppose we should get, uh, I can make some more of those, I suppose we should get some rockets as well, because we're going to need to... We're going to need to clear out some more biters, unfortunately. Not the poor biters. Yep. Uh, how many repair packs do I have on me? Enough. Okay. Uranium's gonna come in. I don't really want to train the uranium in. Do I have to do that? 
คือจุดชักเด็ดมาแม็กบูทไทเนบูทไทเนอุตสาห์นี้จะเป็นร็อกเก็ตฟิวเลยเลยเวลาจะเรียกโอ้ไม่อ้อยไม่อ้อยเลยจิ๊บโอ้โหน่าสุด Sounds uncomfortable. Uh, uh, it is. It's very uncomfortable, actually. It, it... Oh. Wow. Uh... So I think we'll tap off this line here. Mm. Are we making flamethrower? Flamethrower fuel anywhere? I don't believe so. No. Okay. Do you need some? Ah, uh, no, I'll be fine. Okay, so we're gonna go set up all the power poles here, and we'll go clear out these batters down here, I think, and then possibly set up a wall going uh, between the heavily eating dinosaur and the weird donut thing. We'll get a wall going. From there and down to this lake here, and then we'll put a wall in between these lakes, and that should keep this entire area safe. I hope. Maybe put a wall in up here or something. We're gonna want to hook into this coal though, because we're gonna need a lot of coal. So. 88 million coal wouldn't be bad. There's also 75 million stone, which we will also need a lot of when we start sciencing. So I think maybe go take a look down here and see if there's a good way to close that off. Okay. No. So you're getting the power poles in here. That's good. Well, of course. Clean this up afterwards. Uh, we could actually do that. And then we can do uh, probably this. This is all good. This all the way has power poles, so that's good. Uh, well, it's missing some belts. Just a few. There we go. I don't know how much rocket fuel we actually need here. Not a great deal, by the way. 
we'll go with something a bit. We'll deconstruct a bit different. All of that. We'll deconstruct. Enable disabled. If all of your this. I don't know what rocket fuel. What does rocket fuel stack to? Do you know? I have no clue. Awesome. So if it's less than say a hundred, just whatever. So there we go. Okay, so that's set up. That's all ready to go. Ready to rock. It should work beautifully, providing everything I've done makes sense. Which it may not. It may not. <laughs> you never know. You can connect logic to uh, a splitter. Uh, I think you can. You can connect it to a belt. No, so. no, you can't. Oh, okay. No, no, cannot connect wire to the splitter. Okay. Cause I was gonna say, can, can I can I change the splitter so that it only like turns on when you know, like when needed. Output to the left when this is then otherwise output to the right. That would be ah, very useful. Yeah, that would be useful. It only sends stuff this way if yeah condition A is met. Mm -hmm. But no. No, alas, alas, no. But it's fine, it's fine. Would you do it this way? And this is really, like, inefficient. And we're going to have loads of uranium Ooh. on the belt, but... Ah. I don't have any other way to do it. Oh, don't drop, Ooh. don't drop. Ooh, it all stopped, it all stopped. Yeah. The whole world stopped. Yeah, mine too. Stop, stop, stop the world, I want to get off. Oh, there we go. Jesus, that's a big base. They are. Thank God. Thanks. Don't you mean thanks, Spidertron? Yeah, that's true. There you go. Well, Whoa. the world is stopping Whoa. again. Whoa. Yeah, I'm getting that too. How big is the base we're fighting? Uh, we're quite big. Uh, I, I know what's happening. As you're getting further out, I think it's generating the map. Ah, that could be... Uh... That's generating all the all the uh, the biters. It's got to figure out all the parking for the biters. Yeah. It's got to figure out those huge oil patches, which seem excessively large. <laughs> yeah, they do. Found I it. I wonder whether the ore gen mod that we're using has gone slightly wrong out there. But oh well. Uh, yeah, oh well. Yeah. What we'll a terrible shame. Yeah. Found a tiny little iron patch more. And, uh... Yeah, there is, there is a tiny little iron patch next to a huge, great big one. Yeah. <laughs> uh. Oh, crap. I'm out of rockets. Um, you're out of rockets, and, and you're out of time. Oh, no. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Uh, um, I'm going to have to kill these biters before we stop playing, though. <laughs> Because else they're gonna go attack something that we don't want them to attack. 
All right, well, I guess we'll have to call it here. But Fire is really friendly. No. 446 million iron ore. Self-defense. Hmm. 474 yep, million copper next to it, and you haven't even discovered the whole thing yet. Nope. My God, let's just move the base down there. <laughs> yeah. Yes. <laughs> let, let's just move everything. I, 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 I will be honest with you. I think because do you remember when we first started, before we started recording, and I got the settings for the ore gen wrong. Yeah. And they were doing patches that sort of size. Mm-hmm. Like, stupid. I, I reckon that's what's happened. I reckon something's gone wrong, and it's now doing. Because, yeah, I get that they get bigger, but that hasn't just, like, progressively got bigger. It's gone from, like, hey, here's 20 million, here's 30 million, to here's 165 million. Yeah. Here's 400 million. But I'm not complaining, and, you know, we just need to exploit the resources. We're, 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 we deserve it. We deserve it. We do. Yeah. Okay. So yeah, I suppose we shall leave this one here, shall we, and uh, come back next time. Yeah. So, uh, thank you all very much for watching. Uh, we hope you have enjoyed this one, and hope to see you again next time. And until then, as always, have fun. Bye-bye.